Oh, my name is uh, Billy Kirkwood, and I'm a stand-up comedian, kind of actor, and I play the cult of many faces in Cops and Monsters. I'm Wendy Weiss, and I play Lucy Hedges in Cops and Monsters. Hi, I'm James McKenzie, and I play Neil Hedges. <laughs> no, I play Neil Hedges in Cops and Monsters, and uh, yeah, we're husband and wife. Uh, how did they get involved with Cops and Monsters? Well, originally I was doing some stand-up gigs at the uh, Stan Comedy Club in Glasgow. I think that's right. Yes. And uh, the director, creator, the man behind the kingpin of Cops and Monsters, Fraser, he came and saw me and uh, we, got, we got friendly. Um, uh, maybe I had too friendly. I remember one time when he was working on my back in the steam bath after one of our friendlier sessions and he said, I would like you to play the cult of many faces, the villain and uh, have some monsters and I said I'd love to, I'd love to. You need to be evil, you need to be vampiric, people need to die at your hand and I went these are all things I list on my CV already as a thing. Murderous, kill people, clean driver's license. So that's, uh, that's how it came about. I got a phone call from my agent saying about the script in, would you like to have a read of it? And I did and said I really really like this. Um, sign me up and that's how easy that, that was for me. Mm. Uh, Fraser um, trolled me on Twitter and uh, wouldn't leave me alone. Uh, tried last year. Uh, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> well, you actually, I'm half, I'm half kidding. He didn't troll me. Is. He did get in touch initially uh, with me on Twitter uh, last year uh, and asked me if I fancied being involved. I couldn't because of work. Uh, and he got in touch again recently, and so I said um, that that would be great. And uh, he sent me a script. And uh, I've watched some of the episodes online, and a few friends did it as well. So, yeah. Uh, do you know what attracted me to the project? Uh, I thought it was an opportunity to do something a little different, something uh, ambitious. I think sometimes filmmaking, particularly in Scotland, can set the bar really low. And I thought it was going to be something fun. I thought it was going to be something nice and creative and something, no pun intended, I could get my teeth into. What attracted me to it is like, it's, it's really different. I think you get quite a lot of scripts in where it's sort of a similar thing. Especially for me, it's often like, I get, because I do stand up as well, I've got quite a lot of funny scripts in where the woman says the feeder line and then the guy gets the punchline. And it's kind of annoying after a while. And then I got sent this and it was a little bit different, it was a little bit more interesting. And, you know, she's quite a strong character. Um, it was, uh, well, first and foremost, it was uh, that it was homegrown, I think, you know, that it doesn't happen very often. Um, and uh, and that's something that should be supported, I think, absolutely. And like I say, also um, Fraser had kind of uh, had got in touch to, to, to ask me to be involved, and so I, I didn't at that time know anything about it. So I, I looked, found some episodes online and watched it. I thought it was great. And then a few actor friends of mine, like I said, had, uh, had been involved, and they said it's great fun. You should uh, you should definitely give it a go. And uh, yeah. Uh, what am I filming today? I am filming the finale episode of Cops and Monsters, this series. Uh, so uh, I am filming the bad one of that today. It's cool, for first scene, done it, nailed it. I think I say, first time straight out of the gate. So there was no mistakes. And I didn't... Now come on now! <laughs> it's my parole officer. Uh, but he's very angry if I waste any time because I've got an ankle bracelet on and I need to be back at the hostel around about, you know, half eight. Today we're filming a couple season of sort of finale. Season finale. Season finale. I've got a few exciting bits. I don't want to give away any spoilers, mm. but I get to um, I get to taste someone. Can I, is that a spoiler? That's possibly a spoiler. Possibly a spoiler. Yeah. It's very exciting. I get an action bit. Um, yes. What she said. <laughs> My message to Copper Monsters fan is: keep telling everyone, keep this growing. Don't let it, don't let it die. Don't let it die. See that girl? See that girl you left? Don't let it be like her. Don't let it be like her. Cops and Monsters need your help. Don't be like that. Be a donor. <laughs> Sorry. That's all I've got. Oh, good. Yeah, cheers. I think we nailed it, guys. Thank you very much. Um, and to uh, Hellcat1987. You're right. I am quite cute. Cheers. Bye. Keep watching. Thanks. Keep watching. Keep Thanks supporting. for having us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, keep watching. Uh, lots more to come. Hopefully, hopefully a lot more to come. Season two. Upward inflection. <laughs>